Yeah, I think Queensland are really fortunate. Yeah, I'm really excited the fact that uh, they've been able to transition the way that they have. Uh, not many organisations get the opportunity to do it uh, this way. And I think for Queensland to continue success, um, yeah, I think, I think it's a really intelligent way of doing it. Uh, the Reds have got uh, the small staff, I'd say, in Super Rugby. Um, so you know, each of the staff, I think, have to uh, be knowledgeable and work across a number of areas. Certainly my experiences in Europe uh, with the Wallabies and across Western Australia, you know, I've got some ideas on how to play the game and, uh, and challenge uh, the group and the staff to get better. Yeah, I, I think uh, obviously from an outside uh, point of view, it's important that I come here and um, you know, I challenge the thinking of the group. Uh, the group have been successful and I think um, you know, that's recognised that 11,500 people have already signed up as members for 2013. Uh, but, but my job is to come here and uh, help the group get better. Yeah, I, I have, uh, yeah, I've worked under some really good people both uh, in the United Kingdom and in Australia. So, yeah, the experiences obviously hold you in good stead. Uh, I've got a really good relationship with uh, Ewan. And one of the attractions uh, coming back to Queensland was uh, further developing myself uh, working alongside him. I think yeah, the, Reds, the Reds have got the formula right at the moment. They've uh, got a very strong uh, presence in the community. Now, I've been out there coaching uh, among schools and clubs and uh, the number of kids that actually want to talk about the Reds is unprecedented. So they've done a fantastic job in that sense and you can see that uh, their support Suncorp Stadium on a weekend.